Cetus is a mythical sea monster from Greek mythology. It is often described as a giant sea serpent with a huge body and multiple heads, some accounts say it has two, while others mention as many as fifty. Its skin is said to be impenetrable, making it nearly invincible. As a sea monster, Cetus has the ability to breathe underwater and move swiftly through the ocean depths. It is also said to have the power to create powerful storms and tidal waves, which it can use to capsize ships and wreak havoc on coastal communities. Cetus is usually found in the oceans around Greece and other Mediterranean countries, although it has also been reported in other parts of the world. Its natural habitat is deep ocean waters, where it can hunt for prey and remain hidden from human sight. The origin of Cetus is unclear, but it is believed to have been born from the primordial gods of Greek mythology. It reproduces asexually, creating offspring through a process of division or fragmentation. The purpose of Cetus is to terrorize sailors in coastal communities, often at the behest of vengeful gods or goddesses. It is said to sleep during the day and hunt at night, making it a dangerous threat to those who venture out on the ocean after dark. To shield oneself from the powers of Cetus, it is recommended to wear protective charms and amulets. There are also spells and incantations that can be used to ward off the creature. Surviving an encounter with Cetus is challenging, but it is recommended to stay out of the water during the night, when the creature is most active. If caught in a storm created by Cetus, it is advised to seek shelter immediately. To lure and trap Cetus, one could use decoys and bait to attract the creature. However, given its enormous size and strength, it is not recommended to attempt to trap or capture it. The only known way to defeat Cetus is through the use of heroic measures, such as the intervention of a powerful hero or the aid of a deity. In some accounts, the monster is defeated by being shot with a magical arrow or being outsmarted in a battle of wits.